Hello viewers, in this module we are going to discuss about exercise 2, first question, state whether true or false. So all rectangles are squares. So rectangles means like this. So this one will be rectangle, all angles will be 90 degrees but not all sides are equal. Then all rectangles are not squares. So, this is false. Next, all rhombuses are parallelograms. So, rhombuses means all sides will be equal in and opposite angles will be equal. So, opposite sides will be parallel to each other and equal. So, then all rhombuses you can call it as a parallelogram. So, that will be true. Next, all squares are rhombuses and also rectangles. So all squares are rhombuses and also rectangles. So squares. So for in order to say all squares are rhombuses, so here opposite sides are parallel to each other and equal. All sides are equal. Then rectangles means opposite sides are equal and making all the 90 degrees. Then you can say all squares are rectangles. That is true. Next, all squares are not parallelograms. All squares are not parallelograms. So, square means all sides are equal, opposite sides are parallel to each other and same in length and having diagonals. All squares are not, all squares are parallelograms. You can call, but it is false. That is false. Next, all sides are rhombuses. You can call it all sides are rhombuses. No. Kite will be like this. Adjacent pair of sides will be equal. Opposite and all sides are not equal. Then it is false. All kites are not rhombuses. But all rhombuses you can call it as kites. All rhombuses are kites. Yes. All rhombus, adjacent pair of sides will be equal. Then making diagonals. Then we can call it as a, all rhombuses are kites. That is true. All parallelograms are trapeziums. So, parallelogram will be like this. Trapezium, yes, one pair of adjacent, one pair of opposite sides should be equal in trapezium. So, here any one pair of opposite sides are equal, then you can true. All squares are trapeziums, squares. Any one pair of opposite sides should be equal. So, for that, it is true. Then our second question is, Explain how square is. Explain how square is quadrilateral. In order to say quad any shape is quadrilateral, it should contain four sides: one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and four angles. Then we can call it as a square as quadrilateral. Next, parallelogram. In pair of opposite sides. So here pair of opposite sides AB equal to BC and parallel to each other. AD is parallel to BC and same in length. So for that square is parallelogram. Rhombus. A square is rhombus. In rhombus all sides should be equal. Here also AB, BC, DC and DE all are equal. Then nine opposite angles should be equal. So here opposite angles are equal to each other, making diagonals right, right angle, right angle, or bisect each other. Then you can call it as a also rhombus. So many conditions are satisfying with square for rhombus. Next for rectangle, all the angles are 90 degrees and opposite sides are in equal length. AB is equal to DC. BC is equals to AD, then all the angles are 90 degrees. Then we can call it a square as rectangle. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe.